of laugh, laughing yoga with a very special guest. So without further ado, allow me to introduce our special guest who is with us here all the way from Southern California, Palm Springs, no less, the wonderful, the one and only Yogiji Ramesh. Thank you. Yogi Ramesh. Thank you for joining us, Yogiji. I know you have been on, you've been on Oprah, <laughs> you've been on the Roseanne show, you've been on CBS. I know you're, you're, you're regarded as a bit of the Hollywood Yogi. That's your kind of nickname. <laughs> but I know that that's not just a, that's just not a fad. You've actually been training in yoga for 50 years, if I'm not mistaken. Your spiritual you. master, your, your Guruji is from India. You're a member of the California Yoga Teachers Association and the founder of the Universal Yoga Center. Is that right? That's right. And that's and, Wonderful. And uh, hot off the press, it appears you are on a well-known show out there called America's Got Talent. What yeah. you, how was that? What was your experience being on America's Got Talent, especially with the current climate? Yeah, I had a last Wednesday on a big show, big stage in Pasadena. They were shooting like uh, 200 people and 1,000 people on audience and uh, producer likes me she said yogi what you can do for america i say i'm doing for the world what removing fear of coronavirus and prevention with laughing therapy and everybody rouses them yeah yeah we need it that's why i have a little clip you yeah, i've sent it to you for 35 seconds laughing with talented people making them laugh making them be laugh. happy 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 I did it. Everybody really said, wow, wonderful. And they liked it. <laughs> so this is massive because, and we'll get into this in a minute, but allow me to introduce somebody who I've known pretty much always to be Mr. Happy in the UK, who happens to be a good friend of mine. He is right here with me. He is a seasoned radio presenter extraordinaire. He has an excellent track record as a radio presenter, a relationship expert. He runs great dating events. And of course, he's a hunky, green, sexy, vegan goddess, comedian as well. <laughs> Stop it up for Mr. Amit Soda. <laughs> Wait. Welcome. Namaste. Namaste. <laughs> Namaste. How you doing? I mean, I mean, I mean I, I, obviously, you're meeting Yogiji for the first time. What are your observations here? I know Yogiji seems to be a bit of a force out there in the US, but trying to spread laughter. What's your take? You're a comedian. What's your take on the whole comedy and the laughter thing? So two things, obviously, you can see straight away that he's always smiling. It's, mm. a, it's always a, an indicator about someone and who they are and what's going on inside. And then the second thing is a really cool hat. I've never been able to call, pull off cool hats before, but, uh, you know, I'm jealous of people who can. <laughs> right here. <laughs> Yogiji, what is your secret? What is your oh. secret? <laughs> I'm going to see this all within our hearts, you know, when we open our heart, everything comes up, boo, boo, it's all waiting to come out. This is a, a, a spiritual, like a, something inside of us with joy, love, and peace. It's in our heart. Suffering, pain, mental health problems in our mind, subconscious mind. So you have to open your heart mm. to rejoice in the Lord, feel the bliss, feel the joy. Basically, we are not this body and mind. We are spiritual soul, science of universal light within. So what are we waiting for? Why not open our heart, which brings the joy, love, peace, and light? That's who we are. But we have to go inside through breathing and laughing. And then it opens up, then you can have beautiful life. No fear of coronavirus. Boo, boo, go, go, boo, it's gone. <laughs> so what so I find what fascinating you about what you're saying is some people would argue that it flies in the face of science. And yet there are other people, Emile Kuh, for example, the noted French psychiatrist, who is famous for having people, patients, look in the mirror and fake it till they make it and keep repeating that they're happy, that they're satisfied, and they gradually became that way. And so actually there is evidence to back what you're saying. Yogiji, I'm, I'm curious, what have you been doing in recent times now uh, that is counteracting the doom and gloom of the coronavirus? Yeah, uh, you go, uh, what happened actually, uh, people are suffering due to ignorance. They don't know, they don't do breathing because disease cannot live in oxygen. 
So more you do breathing, you energize your cells. And cells are guard bodies are first. You are what your cells are. And disease cannot live in oxygen. You are what your cells are. Bruce Lipton would be proud of that, right, Amit? You are <laughs> Absolutely. <cells> are. <laughs> so breathing energizes your cells, and cells creates what? Endorphin hormones from the brain. They are natural killer. Cancer cells die when virus cannot enter inside, and they boost the immune system. Yeah! Yeah, man! You got it! Yeah! <laughs> now I know that, you know. Uh, go on, Amit. Sorry, you were going to ask? No, I, I was just about to say something, actually. that reminded me of something that a friend reminded me of recently. So, um, Yogi Ji, I don't know if you're familiar with the Iceman, Wim Hof? At all? He's the... Uh... Yeah. Yeah, he's, he's the gentleman, for anyone who doesn't know as well, for Yogi G or anyone else, uh, he's a gentleman who's known for uh, doing a lot of self-experimenting, but showing that he can control his body, his biology, because he does a lot of things where he's like submerged in like buckets of ice and, you know, and he's uh, held many world records for climbing Everest in a pair of sandals and things like that. Um, and he teaches this breathing technique as well, which I've actually been putting into practice for the last couple of days, uh, which actually, if anyone who's not tried it, you should try it. It's a really good way of just really energizing the body. But it's, you know, it's very similar. We've all got hundreds and different of techniques, but the question is, do people actually put them into practice? Do they use them? Do they, even just one, doesn't matter what the technique is, laughing, breathing, smiling, happy energy, physiology, whatever it is, doesn't matter. But if people just took one technique and reapplied it, they, it would just make so much difference to their lives. I think that's massive. And Yogi Ji, I know. Thank you, Amit. And Yogi Ji, obviously, this has been your single pointed message for all these years. Everything you put out, everything you publish, all the studies. I know you've been the subject of some degree of scientific scrutiny and experiments, if I recall. Uh, the press have had some fun at you and they've tried to challenge your, your, your claims. And yet you've somehow built a following of loyal testimonials of people who have had positive benefits from what you do. Is this something we can try here? Is it something that anyone, is there any restriction for anyone to do this from any walk of life? Or could almost anyone try the techniques that you're suggesting? Yeah, I think, you know, uh, what happened, like uh, fear is in the mind. Can you catch fear? Mr. Fear, where are you? I'm not there. So keep your hands on the stomach and breathe out 20 times. When you breathe in, the stomach goes out. When you breathe out, it pumps up blood to the heart. Heart purifies your blood vessels, purified blood. And it goes to the brain and energizes your brain cells. So, wow. detoxification of your toxicity in your gastrointestinal system. All diseases start from the stomach. The virus goes inside the stomach. Then it goes to your lungs. It's like uh, electricity Shh, running inside. So you clean it out. You're breathing out carbon dioxide, hydrogen, nitrogen, all the virus inside your system going out, getting more oxygen, mean joy, love, and peace and light, changing your cells. So cells are what you are. So cells need oxygen therapy and they energize your immune system and you start feeling better. So breathing helps to clean it out, right. detoxification of toxicity inside. Then you hard open up. <laughs> all right so if that's so so that being the case we understand that it is accessible to all uh we're not obviously you know uh making any exaggerated or false claims here it is very much an experiential practice we have to try it ourselves uh, no race religion creed or color is barred from it and it can be done yogiji more or less at any time or place uh, other than on, maybe on a full stomach, but other than that precursor, it's uh, suitable for most people at any time? Yeah, I mean, you can do uh, empty stomach is much better because once the stomach is empty, you can breathe out the toxicity and then it will energize your immune system. Then your heart, your lungs, your kidney, your colon, all your internal organs get energized. They all need oxygen. 
we have a hundred trillions of cells, 72,000 nerves. Your body needs six pound oxygen. We only had one and a half pound. Gosh, nobody does breathing. Oh, hmm. I'm breathing. No, you're not breathing. You are just autonomous response to you how it's breathing. Yeah. It's yeah. unconscious breathing, not conscious breathing, as you're about to this demonstrate. Yeah, that's most important, right? So I'm a, I don't know about you, but I'm, you know, I'm all geared up. Folks, I don't know about you guys as well. I think uh, we need to see this in action. Amit, are you ready I'm to? Ready to I'm ready to see it in action. Can I, can I ask Yogi G a quick question, actually? I wonder if you've had anyone who's come to you really, like in a bad way, they're not in the mood to laugh or be happy <laughs> at all. And um, how have you transformed, like, you know, what have you done to get them laughing or changing? you know, that position they're in, you know, what's, what's kind of an example of where someone's been in a really bad way, um, what you've done to turn it around. Yeah, great. <laughs> I guess, you know, that... uh, uh, Prash, I have a letter of recommendation from doctors, Mofoy, Dr. Smith, and Dr. All medical doctor, I have a cardiologist, hematologist, oncologist, and they see your prescription for happiness, laughing yoga. So right. this is yeah. this is your course, yeah. And it works because nobody has bought truth about life that you can get better, get healthy, and energize your body and mind. This is something scientific, science of happiness, science of life, science of celebration life. It's all there, cancer prevention. I have worked for about 30 years in America and did a lot of television shows. Even UK made a film on me, Soul Seeker, Laughing Yogi. Doctor came from UK. You know, UK people like me. I say, hey, this guy make me happy. So that's the way I'm creating this truth about life. Truth and about life. And the truth about happiness. So yeah. I think it's time for us to experience it. So folks, if you're ready, obviously the obligatory disclaimer, none of the three very Radiant people that you see on the screen right now are medically qualified. So please uh, take this and do this with your own faith. But having said that, if we can all do this with our own faith, have a little bit of healthy skepticism and dive in with an open heart, I think we can start to experience the results, Yogiji, that you're talking about. So Yogiji, over to you. Uh, and uh, Amit, <laughs> I'm going to love this one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Yogiji. Yes, go ahead. Please. Yeah, I would like to, you know, the basic thing that you know, people need to breathe in, breathe out, and clap. Ho, ho, ha, ha, ha. 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 Take it unless you make it. <laughs> Try to laugh unless your stomach starts hurting. <laughs> you got it. <laughs> so this is like your children laugh 400 times a day. There's so much joy. Help your soul. We grow up, we get logical mind, judging people, thinking, and conscious go to sleep inside. Mm. Mind runs here and there, but the happiness comes from the heart. Because heart where the Lord lives, right? So you have to open your heart. Breathe, laugh, laugh. Live, B-L-L-L, -L -L. that's my philosophy. And all free, Prash, it's all natural. People need to understand this life is within you. We all born from inside, we all die from inside. <laughs> and we never think about inside. Mm. That's why the Bible says kingdom of God is within you, but nobody, this pastor never teach you how to open the heart inside. Sorry, this is a truth time. Let's open up the heart some more. Let's open up the heart some more. Let's do some more. <laughs> That's why it came to me after 39 years practicing yoga. 
and opening the heart. You know, God never created duplicates. He made you special. He made Amit special. He made Yogi special. Go and rock the world. So I said, okay, that's my job. I born to energize <laughs> America and the world. So I'm doing what God wants. Yeah, so baby. Amit, uh, you're feeling this, Amit. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Come on, Yogiji, take us through some more. Ho, ho. What's the next one? What's the next one? <laughs> Life is Ooh. fun. God loves fun. So we got to be funny like a child. Don't be too serious. No, no, a lot of people are very serious. I'm this, I say I'm nothing, I'm just yogi. I want you all to be happy. Happiness is natural, our birthright. It's just free mind and disease free body is our birthright. We born happy, remember? <laughs> but this is in our heart. They have not opened the heart inside. So they're working with the mind doing the job. It's time for awakening the heart within. And once your heart open up, your mind becomes calm. Fearless mind by opening your heart. That's why I say medicine of laughter for coronavirus. Laughter is free, breathing is free, and energizing your body and mind is free. So this is all science of breath, science of laughter for energizing your inner body, body of the creator within. And feeling good doesn't cost anything, just not a dime even. Ho, ho, ha, ho, ha, ho, ho. <laughs> And you feel good instantly. Laughter for instant happiness. Driving car in London. Ha, 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 ha. Still, his diaphragm is working. His stomach pumping oxygen to the heart. This is the inner recovery, inner healing. You can't see from this eye. In only microscope, you see, oh, wow. <laughs> the medical science cannot find happiness. The hard work. So, Never so, done research on happiness. A lot of doctors said, how yeah, do you know how do do that? happening? They don't know. They have no idea. No. Because it's something it's spiritual. Yogis, they research inside. They search for divine. Who am I? Why am I here? What is the purpose of my life? To celebrate life. God loves fun. That's why he created yogi. He is happy. <laughs> so laughter is contagious. You can do 24-7, anywhere, anytime. Five minutes breathing and one minute laughter can increase your immune system for 24 hours. And one minute anger can reduce your immune system for four to five hours. Wow. Yeah. yeah this that's is massive. That's, uh, that's significant. Amit and I have a, a mutual, a couple of mutual friends. One of them yeah. comes to mind. He lives out a lot in Spain. He's a miserable git. Um, there's a few people <laughs> who are quite miserable. <laughs> Um, and we also know people who are misery faces. I want to ask you a question. What can we do? What can people out here listening in or watching this do when they're in the middle of a situation where they're having an argument or they're getting into a tense clash with somebody that they love? How can they diffuse it with this laughter in a way that would not offend anyone? So if some, suppose you are mad at me, I'll say, hey, hey, but, hey, hey, hey. Would you do it with that smile? Yeah. Hey, hey. <laughs> yeah. That's isn't, isn't, that kind of like, um, isn't that kind of like um, those 1970s Indian movies like Amitabh Bachchan? Hey, hey. Come on. Hey, Jyoti. Jyoti. Mahadev ka slogan hey. Left, left. Left, left, Amit. Left, left. Left, left. Left, left. Or... You know, people don't get sleep at night. Insomnia, biggest problem. I get a laughing pill. Hope. <laughs> Hope. <laughs> like a placebo, right? We take the laughing pill. Yeah, laughing pill. Or drink your coffee. <laughs> <laughs> Laugh for no reason. Because laughter is the best medicine. It increases your endorphin, the natural painkiller. They remove the cortisol, stress-inducing chemical, and you start feeling mood-enhancing endorphin. Happy, 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 happy. You get in the morning, hey, today is my beautiful day. I am happy, happy, happy. I am happy, happy, happy. I am happy, happy, happy. I am happy like a child. You know, children's 
even though we don't feel it, just to be, just to play devil, just again to clarify, even though we may not be feeling happy when we wake up, we may be feeling tired, angry, lazy, want to go back to bed, depressed that, you know, our life is over. If we're feeling anything other than happy, are you proposing that we fake it and still try to be happy? Yeah, that's right. Fake it unless you make it. Because what? unless you do it, your mind cannot create hormones, endorphins. That natural what? painkiller. Where's the best place to start? Breathing, walking around, moving around, not enjoying the real wisdom of soul within you. You can do use in business, in your family, in your communities, and spread the light of laughter, joy of soul, and then make everyone happy. It's boost your business, and you are relaxed, and no stress, no tension, no uh, problem, and you can enjoy your day. Today is my laughing day. Today is my laughing day. Hey, oh, yeah. Today is my laughing day. Today is my laughing day. Today is my laughing day. Yeah. Today is my laughing day. I have to say that. Laughing day. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> Can I say that whatever, you know, one thing that always makes me laugh is when I'm at Cook's. <laughs> yeah, it's funny, great, wonderful. How did you have a friend there that's I'm very proud of that? Wow, well, well, yeah, I'm glad I got a friend. There are a few people I would call friends. And I know that Amit, you're a big fan. I know Amit, can, is it okay to wake up to a cartoon? I know that um, I used to grow up watching the Flintstones, even when I was in my 20s. Oh, I had yeah. an episode of the Flintstones on in the morning or some kind of Tom and Jerry, or, or, you know, or, or Sergeant Bilko, for those of you who are tuned in and old enough to remember that black and white series. <laughs> <laughs> that would always get me going. Uh, I'll tell you what, Paras, right? My, uh, so uh, I'll tell you a story. There's a, there's a show, I don't know if you've seen it, called The Practical Jokers. Oh, yeah, The Practical Jokers. Four, four, the, four, the Four Guys, yeah, The Four Guys based in New York. So I was a big fan of them before I met Neil. And... Um, uh, and Nithi saw me laughing my backside off the show one day. She's like, what you, these, you know, these guys are really silly. They're stupid. You know, like, why are you laughing at them? And I said, look, I just find them hilarious. I love watching them. <laughs> About two years later, after Nithi and I moved in, I, she was in the other room. And all I heard her was just laughing so hard. I was, you know, she was just like, <laughs> type thing, right? She's literally <laughs> laughing her backside off. And I walk into the room and she's watching Impractical Jokers. Yeah? She loves them now. So funny, and I watch them all the time as well because it just makes me laugh. You know, they, they do such silly things, but I don't care. It makes me laugh. It makes me happy. That's so, right. That's great. I mean, that's what we all need in our life. Exactly. Because it's a massive. You, cannot, you can do it, uh, Prash. Silent laughter, no sound. <laughs> like Dustin and Motley, right? I mean. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's that's more like a wheezy cough, like someone who's been smoking for forty years. Right? <laughs> you know, be be normal, be gentle, breathe. Because breathing energizes your cells. Then you can laugh. If you don't breathe, Prash, then you can't get it out. When your cells said, "I didn't get to breathe by oxygen, I can't laugh." Your cells talk to you. Like you fill up your gas tank before you yeah. drive your car. You need gas. You need oxygen in the cells. 100 trillion of cells. How can you energize them? Give them money. No, I don't need money. I don't need car. I, don't, I need yeah, oxygen first. So no oxygen body dies. Less oxygen body cries. And more oxygen body flies. No tax on it. <laughs> <laughs> no but, but for how long, right? How long? No <laughs> tax, long no time. tax. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's why I say fill your body with oxygen, a therapy for polluted world. You know, uh, this has come from my heart, you know, you know, because I'm here to make the world happy as Amit is doing it, you are doing it. So we are part of creative creation. So we have to know why we come on this earth, not just to make money, suffer and die. We came to create something new, health and healing in America and the world. The world need happiness and we are the foundation of tomorrow. A new world, new life, 
new joy, all waiting to come out. It's a conscious awakening, celebrating life with Amazing. joy, love, and peace. Joy, and love, and Amen. Amen. Amen to that. <laughs> Amen to that. Yogi Ji, I think you reiterated something that certainly Amit and I, as long standing coaches, I think firmly believe in, agree on, which is how we feel is all that's really important. It's all important. I mean, I know that you, when you were out with Tony Robbins a few months ago, this was something that you, I think you reiterated when you came back, right? That how we feel is, is king. It's not yeah. how much money we've made because we may have the money, but we may not feel good. And there are, let's be honest, there are people with six figure salaries watching this right now who are suffering because of this current epidemic. Because right. what they're feeling and what they have in the bank account are disconnected, they're disjoined. And so if we can change the way we feel as Yogi Ji, as you're uh, rightly educating us, then that is the most important gift that we can give to ourselves and to other people around us. Ha <laughs> ha. And you know, trust um, there's no competition because I uh, find out anybody teaching laughing yoga in the world, nobody's teaching this because it's my practice. I do it. I don't read book and teach laughing because you can't find happiness in the book. You can't find God by reading book. You have to search with him. Mm. Mm. Said, you can't find God by reading book. You have to search with him. So once you search, you find what? Joy, love, and peace. It's all waiting to come out. <laughs> JFP, joy, love, peace. It's a consciousness. My cells inside. I'm 25 years old, doctor told me. Uh, Thomas Yerma in Kuwa, he said, check my blood. He said, Yogi, my God, I want to hire you. How much? I said, Dr. Thomas, <laughs> not by my soul. I'm here to serve humans, serve God. Oh, God. I take care of Lord's body. I take care of Lord's body. Eat well, yeah. sleep well, think well, and do well, and be positive all the time. Doesn't matter. Lord is with me, and I know that's true. People may not realize it, that their journey, God bless them. You are doing great, I'm doing great. But we need to combine together uh, prayers, and we can open up a laughing center in uh, London, Laughing London, Laughing UK. Laugh laughing UK. This is a foundation opening a laughing club in the world. And we can do that because we are the founder of happiness, creating happiness. Laughter is not joke. You're creating from inside. Mm, it's not in book. It's within our heart. So creating happiness is joy, love, and peace. And living with mind is suffering, pain, disease. Am I ah. right? Amen. Amen <laughs> again. Amen again. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know, you know what you just said, Yogi Ji, that you know, people come, you're like, I'm the servant, you know, it, you know, this is all free and everything. I would say that when I do my clients, I say the same thing, but yet my wife needs lots of good things, so for that I charge. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I have a I have a character. I my services I have a character. My Let me services me. may be free. But then I need to have some money. Of course you do. There we go. Of course you do. I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> no, 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 no. Let me do my little impersonation. That's a good time. I've got an impersonation I do of a kind of like a guru character. It's just a random impersonation. It feels appropriate since the, you just made that point about money. So uh, let, me have, let me give a go. Let me do this impersonation. One sec. Okay, here we go. So... I am sitting here, my eyes are half closed, I am in the meditation. And when I am in the meditation, I am seeing all the future for all my children. You are my children. What do you have to worry? Just give up the materialism. Live in the simple life. <laughs> Eat once a day, only tofu. Because tofu is organic and tofu is close to God. And my dear children, why are you drinking just plain water? You must always add little bit of lemon juice and chili powder. It will stimulate the colon. 
You see, happiness lies in the colon. Happiness is in the colon. When you have a good shit, when you have a good stool, you can feel happy. How you know the proof of this? You are asking me, Guruji. Well, I'll tell you, my child. You try to eat lots of food, and then you take laxative, and then you close the anus, and then you try to do your work. Within few minutes, your head will complain, your chest will complain, your lungs will complain. Only the asshole is king. So the truth is, learn to poo properly. When you poo properly, then you will be very happy. And you are not a lone child. All for all of you, my disciples, I have my program for the small price of two thousand four hundred and ninety-nine dollars. You can take the program, and I will teach you how to poo properly. It is called how to poo with bliss. And today it is on early bird price. So only one thousand nine. Okay. Wow. <laughs> happy, happy, happy. Right. Funny. <laughs> Sorry, it was really inside me. I had to get that one out. <laughs> There's a few others too. I'm in those. You um, there's quite a few, isn't there? <laughs> Folks, uh, on, on a serious note, and we've talked about laughter. If you are going through a tough time, let Yogi G's ample example show us that happiness can be achieved through elevating our feelings. And if we have to fake it till we make it. And that's what we've got to do because we're doing that in any other area of our life anyway. If you want to have some dealings and improve your relationship, take it to the next level, reach out to Amit. Amit's right here. He is an expert. He's been doing this for years. If you want to slot on his radio show, good luck. Join the queue. <laughs> uh, and for those of you who have the chance to go out to Palm Springs, go and meet yeah. PG in person. He runs his workshops throughout the weeks. I know you go to Arizona, you travel a lot and you're doing it and you're invited. Um, of course, we'll, we can't wait to watch you on America's Got Talent and bring uh -huh. your laughter to that audience. So we'll look forward to that. And hopefully Yogiji will have you back and you know, we'll do something together, maybe as a combined thing, an interactive thing with people. We'll do a laughter yoga session again if you need that. Yeah, I'm doing a uh, program in Hawaii is called uh, International Day of Yoga, June 22nd, my friend. Uh, Raj Kumar has invited me. They're opening a big center, happiness laughing center. Wow. So I got an invitation to go there in Hawaii in June and do like 500 people coming and learn about how to be happy, how to be healthy, how to energize your body and mind. I have been five, six times at your workshop. Okay. So same day, wherever you plan, you and Ramita together, run it out and I'll be with you. And we can do a workshop for mental health recovery drug, alcohol, depression, anxiety, um, seniors, old timer, Parkinson. It's like a energizing the body and mind by laughing, happy, healing signs of laughter. And I'll be ready to work with you, whatever your plans, and let's do it. And people you like donate that. to whatever you want. I'm you sure know, if you, if you got to the enter. UK, I'm sure yeah. I would probably have you on the radio show, I'm sure. Um, yeah, absolutely. UK 2020. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely, right? Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> um, Yogi, on a serious note, just on a serious note, uh, I know that right now there are big restrictions being put in place in the U.S. for travel. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, if it happens that you cannot leave the mainland U.S., as I think that, that, that that's what the administration are going to yeah. do, and you oh, find yeah. that come May, June, you can't travel to Hawaii, yes. yeah? mm -hmm. the U.K. doesn't have a ban to Hawaii. So me and Amit, we're happy to go on your behalf and run that show. In <laughs> no, it will open up channel. It's a, by the moment going on, but 48 thing changes at the time. But for the future, plan it out that open up a, a, laughing, a laughing yoga center. And you and Amit both are there. <laughs> We'd love to do that. Yeah. There's, do there's another lady here, Kalpana Doshi. She's a friend of ours. She's a laughter yoga enthusiast and teacher. And I know that she would bring support to what you're doing, your unique way. But on that note, um, we draw this to a close. Focus, folks, the key here is that we need to recognize. Here we go. Cathedral Sun, the best medicine, City Sun. In the City Sun, yeah. 
the Cathedral City Sun. Absolutely. Everything is truth, you know. Uh, uh, Amit and Prash, we are, you know, divine people. We understand consciousness because we're born in India. People, other people don't know about soul, science of universal light. So when they don't know, they don't know. So I bless them. If they come to me from any part of the world, I say, God has sent you, I welcome you, you are sent by God. Thank you very much. Wow. And you know, they, they respect me because I respect soul, love the soul. Do you have I'm, a soul? We're, right? Absolutely, we're, we're at time. Yogi Ji, follow Yogi at Universal Yogi, universallaughingyogi.org. I'm at unlimitedchoice.com, myself, urban oh. spirituality. I'm urban, unlimitedchoice.org for Amit, uh, urban spirituality.co for myself, prashk.com. We love you loads. Spread the happiness, spread the laughter. Yogi Ji, Amit, thank you so much. Thank Peace out. Love and namaste. <laughs> Take care, everybody. Be strong, be happy. Spread the love. Namaste.